Hey guys, so I'm back here with another video. And today I'm just gonna be telling you what's been going on to my SCX24 Chevy C10. So a little bit ago, Grant from Just Grant, that YouTube channel, he got a 3D printer and he's been 3D printing some things for me. So a huge thanks to him. Make sure to go check out his channel. He has a bunch of 3D printing videos and they're awesome. So today I'm just gonna be showing you what he has 3D printed for me and what changes I have done on my SCX24. So, hope you enjoy. So, I'll start on the bottom. So here, he made me some high clearance links for my SCX24, and he made me some rock sliders. The type of rock sliders he printed are ones that hold pennies, so it keeps the uh, weight down low. 3D printed me this white cap and this roof rack for my Chevy C10, and it looks really good. And I just used these lights on this light bar from the old light or the roll cage on the SCX24 when you get it stock. Here are all the things I took off the SCX24. The links, the roll bar, and this bumper, front bumper, to give more clearance. So I took the lights off of this, like I said, right here. This, this came stock on the truck. And also these did too, and that. But I all took them off just to help. These I might put on because on the bottom here, it gives more room, but the slanted ones actually slide over the rocks as these just kind of get caught up in the middle. So I'll see what happens when I crawl more and if it gets bad, then I'll just put those back on. So got an extended cord for the lights. So I strings all the way up here. So that way the lights just go right through light buckets. Once again, a huge thanks to Grant. More 3D printing videos will come up on his channel. So make sure to check out his channel and make sure to subscribe. Before I end off this video, I'm just going to be showing you what's been going on really around the workbench. You saw I got this nice Durotrex work stand, which is really helpful. I also picked up some extended body mounts from Proline. These are for the Stampede rear and front for the forks for. And they should be really helpful, but I'm not going to put them on until I get a new body because the body is destroyed on the Stampede right now. These will come up in another video soon, so stay tuned. More videos should come out for these cars once it gets a little warmer. I'm starting to make some videos right now, but it's still kind of chilly, especially right now. It's like 39 degrees. We'll see more of these three cars right here in action at the skate park and bike park this summer. And this crawler should be in some action too. I will make a couple more crawler videos for this thing too soon. We can't forget about these vehicles. I already brought this boat out, but it was in Arizona where it was warm. This one, I still have to bring out. It's a little sketchy because it caught on fire once and now it has a bunch of problems. But I'll try to get it out on one of these videos soon. And this one you'll see more. And the buggy right here, I've broken the back shock tower. So I have to get a new spare one. I'll get aluminum. So thank you for watching. Make sure to stay tuned to some of my other videos. And make sure to subscribe.